This is the love story of Dick and Jeannie. Born like a sofa on the summer air. I dream of Jeannie with a light brown hair. I'm going to ask Jeannie a question today. And maybe I'm crowding my luck, but I'm going to ask it anyhow. Listen to our friend for a moment, and then you'll hear me again. Maybe I'm sticking my neck out, Jeannie. But listen, if you saw me kissing a beautiful girl and I told you there was nothing between us, what would you do? Oh, a couple of weeks ago I'd have slapped you, but we're so much closer than we were a couple of weeks ago that, well, I'd trust you completely. Oh, you're wonderful, Jeannie. <laughs> sure I'm wonderful. If you saw me kissing a handsome man like, well, like Ronald the director and... And I told you I was just practicing. What would you do? Uh, when will that radio man make up his mind about you, Jeannie? Oh, goodness knows. Dick, if you saw me kissing a director or a, or a star... Uh, well, I, I'd walk five times around the block, but fast. And then I'd come back and say, I trust you, darling. Do you know what I think? I have a suspicion. You think we're too good to be true. Much too good to be true. But even so, Dick, I'll always suspect you of being completely honest. No matter what you do or say, I'll always believe you when it comes to the important things. I'll be with you in everything I do. In drifting clouds, in passing crowds, there's you. I see your eyes in blue and starry skies. Your laughter sings, the memory clings anew. My darling, you. So very much a part of me I close my eyes And feel you in the heart of me Honestly There is no night Can hide you from my sight In dreams you see in the person you love is half the battle, Jeannie. Are you referring to the battle of the sexes? <laughs> Dick, let's not talk any longer in this vein. We're being silly. Let's listen to our friend here. 